Hey, what's up? I'm Ga. We're in Outer Plane, uh, and I got some hot takes for you guys. Now, these are going to be focusing on Arena. Um, I think Evasion is good, and I think that the current season buff is good. Um, and a lot of you guys are going to disagree with me, but uh, let me kind of explain my standpoint. So, um, if evasion weren't a thing, everyone uh, would be getting hit all the time. And if um, HP weren't a thing, the HP buff, then it would literally just be speed meta. Right? Everyone would just be running Rin and doing speed nukes. Um, and without that extra HP, people on offense probably wouldn't be surviving nearly as much. Um, that being said, I just got nuked out of my mind. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, sit this one out. Um, Normally people don't run Valentine on defense, but it, it really works out in <laughs> certain scenarios. So, yes, evasion and HP buffs for the season uh, result in a lot of super toxic defense teams, kind of like this one I'm looking at at the top right here. Um, it makes healers and defenders uh, obnoxiously tanky, but... Um, there are ways around that. So, one way around it is to use uh, penetration. So, something like this will kind of help, uh, like your attacks actually have a little bit more oomph. Um, you can also run accuracy gear to get around evasion. You can run Cindy to boost accuracy. Um, and then for characters like Mini, who are going to be reviving, and Leo, who's going to be blah 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 blah, invincibility, um, you can run Noah to take out Mini, you can run, uh, Francesca to take out Leo, or you can run Dolly to literally just shut everything off, um, like, as soon as her her skill right here hits, like, there's no more nonsense at all. Like, Leo can't use his invincibility buff, Mini can't revive anybody, Tio can't cleanse this, you don't have to worry about De Demi Stella revenging. As soon as this lands and it wins the, ac or the accuracy and the uh, effectiveness check, like, you're you have free two free turns to just kind of go to town um that being said she does need like a lot of investment to for that to work but um yeah like without evasion and more hp it wouldn't be stall it would just be cleave S speed cleave so there's there's ways to work around these kind of teams you can uh, build a little bit more because you know you're going to have a little bit more time in the match. You can set up a little bit better. Um, and yeah, so like, let's see. Uh, if we go something like this, let me see if I can get this to work. Well, my, my dolly's not done yet. So take this with a grain of salt. She doesn't have a whole lot of uh, evasion, or not evasion, uh, accuracy and effectiveness. But um, you can get something similar to this uh, to kind of shut off a lot of the nonsense. Um, so it's not too bad. Now I do need to know if this will hit through a shield. Hopefully it, it does. I, I wonder if it needs to do like actual damage.
Um, and you can see, yeah, so the only one that didn't get silenced was Hannibal. Everybody else is silenced. So now there's nothing left. Now, if I had enough, um, if I had enough, uh, whatchamacallit, then I would have been able to silence Hannibal as well. Um, but yeah, like, we just got rid of, like, all the, all the nonsense. We got two free turns, essentially. Um, as long as we can get past Hannibal, uh, and not get counterattacked to death, then, uh, yeah. And then we're still free to do this. Um, and now the only thing we have to worry about is, uh... Oh, I thought she was still silenced. Hmm. Well, that's a problem. <sighs> All right. So it's not it's not perfect, but it it kind of works. And now, <laughs> if I could stop triggering counterattacks. That would be great. But yeah, you can see there, like, a, a little bit more investment into my team, um, and that would have worked out perfectly fine. You know, if I had, like, a little bit more crit rate on Noah, a little bit more damage, um, there's, there's definitely ways, like, to counter um, stall meta. But for speed cleave, uh, it, it's literally just whoever has the fastest, strongest characters wins. Like, there's no text you can use to kind of counter that. It's like, oh, okay, well, I guess, you know, without evasion, without some extra HP, I'm just going to die to a Rin nuke, um, and there's nothing you can do about that. Uh, at least this way, like, someone puts up a wall, you got to figure out how to climb over the wall, you gotta figure out how to break through the wall, you can break it down. Um, so that's a lot easier than, uh, you know, trying to dodge a bullet, I guess, right? So it's like, if you are faced with a firing squad, or you are faced with a wall, I would take the wall uh, any day of the week. Um, because at least I can sit here and try to break this down and analyze it, whereas with the firing squad, aka Rin Speed Nuke, uh, it's it just is what it is. Like you kind of know what you're in for. You walk into it, you get nuked, and then uh, you go to the next match. Um, yeah. So I'm one of the weird few that. Uh, like, I'm okay with this meta. Yes, I'm sitting in Diamond 2. Yes, I'm not in Master. Uh, I understand things are significantly more toxic in the higher ranks. But, for where I'm at, I feel like I'm right in, you know, the middle, which is where the majority of people are. Uh, I think this is fine. You know, feel free to disagree with me. Feel free to call me an idiot in the comments. Um, whatever. Like, you can disagree. But, you know, uh, the, the devs are looking at, like, a lot of the feedback, um, a lot of the, the results. Like, I'm sure they're going to be fine-tuning Arena, uh, and hopefully things will only get better uh, from here on out. So if you're not enjoying this current season, then, you know, I'm sure that they're working on improving it. So, um... Yeah, look, look forward to that. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna jump in and see if we can get this to work again. Um, let me see here. Maybe if we swap out Noah for somebody, like, <laughs> we can bring, we can bring Val. Cause if, if Dolly's thing lands then we'll we'll be free to uh to use valentine's uh ult 
See, and this is kind of what I like about this meta. You get to like try out a bunch of different things. Um, unfortunately, it looks like their Leo is going to be faster than my uh, than my Dolly. However, what if just maybe? He won't be if I click this. That seems like an incredibly bad idea. Um, yeah, Dolly wasn't fast enough. She probably lost a uh, speed roll, but yeah, we just she just wasn't fast enough. We're going to extend our buffs. Maybe maybe try to stall things out a little bit here. Interesting that Tio is using her heal when there's like nobody to heal. Uh, this is definitely a problem. <laughs> Whoops. That was bad. Uh, but yeah. Like, literally, Leo just being faster. Like, and this is... This is kind of the problem I have with speed. Um, is that, like... Leo's not incredibly fast? What the hell is going on here? We just got three turns. Is that something that Hannibal does? I have no idea. Oh, I just triggered everybody's counterattack. That's what happened. I gotcha. I'm pretty sure I lost this one. Literally just because Leo was faster than Dolly. I think if Dolly was faster, she could have shut everybody down. But, um... You know, sometimes that's just how the dice roll. And, like, it sucks, but I actually kind of like the RNG of... PvP as well, just because it makes things different each time. So if things were constantly the same, it would get boring. It's it's kind of like playing a card game, right? So um, like you have your deck, you shuffle it up, and you're not going to draw the same cards in your opening hand every time. It's going to be different. And uh, that's that's kind of what this feels like a little bit. Like there's uh, the whole strategy aspect to it, kind of like Pokemon and stuff. Um, but uh, da, 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 da. Uh, there's also a little bit of RNG to it, kind of like uh, you know, like a card game, which is is interesting. It keeps things weird, keeps things uh, random. See, like right there, we just landed the silenced and there's no Leo invincibility. Literally everyone is silenced. So we have to take advantage of this while we can. And just hope that we don't get counterattacked. So like, this is kind of what I'm saying. Like if you have a fast enough dolly with enough accuracy, enough effectiveness, you can shut down um, see, now I'm just free to do this. Um, you can just shut down, like, a lot of the nonsense, like, have someone with enough DPS, and then bada-bing, bada-boom, um, you can kind of just, like, have your way. And all these dead, but that sucks. Wow, lightning, cool, so cool. Um... I don't think we need to do that. Should probably poke away at this shield. See, and then Leo didn't get his evasion buff, so we can just 
clean it up. I feel like that's kind of like a perfect example. Um, now I just need to make my dolly faster, give her more accuracy, give her more effectiveness, so that kind of thing can happen all the time. Um, but a team comp like this would not work if it was a uh, speed cleave meta because Rin would just come in and wipe everybody out instantly. So, um, yeah. And, you know, that's that's kind of like why I like slower uh, meta games. You have a little bit more uh, thinking room, thinking capabilities, whether, you know, uh, if it were just speed cleave meta, it's just unga boonga, go fast, big damage, um, which is fun to an extent, but how many times can you see uh, Rin's nuke and not get tired of it? Oh, cute, counterattack. Alright. This hits. I don't want to say that we win, but... Um, Okay, so Stella didn't get... That's the biggest downside. Oh, Stella's fast too, what the hell? Oh, okay, yep, yeah, this is this is one of the big counters to Dolly. Um, Veronica is just gonna remove the debuff at the start of her turn, but you know, is what it is. At least Leo's still silenced, so no invincibility. There was no Tio nonsense. And boom! Yeah. Dolly put in the work. She did she did what she was supposed to do. Shut off Tio's ult too. So like everyone that's complaining about the current meta, just Think about it. Figure something out. Like, read some characters, build something different and weird and exciting, and just kind of like experiment. Um, and, like, I feel like a lot of weird stuff can work in this metagame right now compared to Speed Cleave, which would just be fast and attack. So, um, yeah, like I said, if you guys disagree with me, let me know. Uh, if you agree with me, let me know. Um, but yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Peace.